Monday through Friday, eight to five. I am at my desk, I am working, I am grinding away. I have a full-time job, okay? But what is life like after work on a normal weekday for someone who works a full-time job? Well, if you're anything like me, you like to have a life outside of work and not just on the weekends. On TikTok, I've heard people say my five to nine after my nine to five. Mine's more like my five to midnight or 1 a.m. because I just stay up way too late. Anyway, here's a day in the life after work. Before we dive into all the fun stuff, like I said, I spend almost all day Monday through Friday at my desk, so it's really important to me that I have a really nice desk to work from. So shout out to today's sponsor, FlexiSpot. So this desk can be a standing desk or a sitting desk, which is why it's my favorite thing ever because I'll spend like half my work day just sitting, getting my work done, and then I'll spend half my day standing or walking. I actually got a treadmill to be able to put under my desk, and my FlexiSpot desk is really great for this transition throughout the day because there's four different slots that you can program to be different heights. I also love this desk because I can charge my phone or my iPad straight from the desk. They have the biggest deals throughout the whole year, up to 60% off. Flexi has eight popular products for their flash sale, which is going on during November 25th through 28th of 2022. And there will be two for each day. There will be multiple activities such as free order. So each of the first 10 customers who place their order between 12 and 9 a.m. on November 25th and November 28th will get their orders for free. And the Comar Standing Desk EW8 is a $160 off between November 25th and November 27th. FlexiSpot has some great deals going on. I don't want y'all to miss out, so make sure to click the link in the description. So I just got off of work. It's a little bit after five. The sun is literally already almost down and I am so mad about it. I don't care how many videos I say this in, I am not okay with it. So the last like two or three weeks, me and my friend Alyssa have been working out every day after work. So she's actually here right now. I am nowhere near ready, so I'm gonna change real quick and then we're gonna go work out. We'll do some leggings, sports bra, t-shirt. Hopefully that transition worked and I wish it was that easy to get ready in real life. Ignore my mess of a room. I need to clean that soon. Putting on my Apple Watch. In my head, a workout doesn't count without my Apple Watch. I know it's not true, but that's how it is in my head. <laughs> All right, Alyssa's here. Actually, she's been here. I was waiting on me. It was good. I watched TikTok. Okay, good. I feel like there's never a time she's come and I'm just ready, so. <laughs> it's okay. I'm glad that you're used to it at this yeah. point. I hope. <laughs> anyway, we are gonna head to the gym. My fanny pack from Halloween. Perfect workout fanny pack. I love it, honestly. Thank you. <laughs> All right, let's go. All right. We're walking over to my apartment gym. And there's literally Christmas music at the pool. It's amazing. <laughs> fanny pack matching bags. Yes. Oh, I always Styling forget to press here. the thing when we get in here. <laughs> okay, now we're going to the gym. Perfect. Shoes immediately off. <laughs> I told Alyssa to play Christmas music and this is what she plays. <laughs> Thomas the Train Christmas music. What? Like why? I, I want to apologize <laughs> to me as well. <laughs> so every time I work out, it's kind of different. Sometimes we'll go on walks, but the sun is literally already down. We're not trying to get kidnapped. So <laughs> we're just gonna work out in here. We're gonna start with a little warm up. I'm gonna put my hair up. Oh my, why? Why did this just happen? But this. Alyssa went home after the workout. I need to go to the store. I was honestly just making TikToks when the light goes down so fast and terrible lighting hits so much sooner. I honestly have been really active on TikTok recently. So I usually will try to like batch stuff whenever I can and then I'll post it like throughout a few days or I'll just post like 20 at once. You really never know, honestly. So I have a video that I need to send to my manager but I don't know why it's taking so long. Okay, now it's uploaded. I was waiting for it the whole time at the gym and it was like not uploaded but now it is, okay. 
So I've got to do this real quick. Also, sometimes after work, which isn't today, uh, Mondays I go see my mentor uh, for like church. She's like my discipleship person. Tuesdays I have my Bible studies. On the weekends or like other days, I will edit videos after work for the YouTube channel. I'm gonna do a little bit of scrolling. I say it's to come up with ideas, but is it really? Okay, I came up with the idea. You know it's a banger when I'm getting my Bible out for the idea. <laughs> sweaty and still wearing my workout clothes but I'm gonna go to the grocery store. I want to wear these shoes because it's more of like a cute casual vibe but I'm walking around to see if they'll actually be comfortable and I don't know I feel like my toes are not vibing with it but I didn't want to wear tennis shoes but I think I will just because it'll be the most comfortable. I'm acting like I'm about to go walk like five miles literally grabbing like five things at the store. <laughs> If I'm being 100% honest, I low-key started to get some anxiety just from some random stuff and so I was just listening to worship music and it made me feel a lot better. Okay, I think I got everything I need from the store for Friendsgiving. I don't even know if I said why I was going to the store. So tomorrow, Alyssa is hosting a Friendsgiving with me and her other girlfriends and I'm making funeral potatoes and corn. So I just went to go pick up those things because I didn't get them when I went grocery shopping last and I'll make them tomorrow after work. It's kind of weird like since being in a relationship I'm just so used to like doing everything either with my boyfriend or okay bangers or doing stuff with like Alyssa or other friends. So going to the store alone is kind of like a refreshing like oh I actually do like spending time with myself. I prefer it with someone else but I think it's also good to have a balance like sometimes doing things on your own. I'm just putting away all the food I got for the funeral potatoes. Well, also when I got to the store, I was genuinely so confused because my watch was saying it was like six o'clock and my phone was saying that it was eight o'clock. And then I just reset my watch and it was eight o'clock. I was like, who's lying to me? And I'm very confused. And with the sun, I really have no idea what time it is. Now, it is dinner time. All right, babe, do you want brisket steak burgers or the Wagyu beef burgers? Wagyu. Okay. And my boyfriend is literally watching videos about the American Revolution? I don't understand. Also, I am making dinner by myself tonight. A lot of nights we'll cook together, some nights he'll just cook, but I've been loving cooking recently, so I'm like, don't cook with me tonight, at least. Well, ever since I started working out after work, I don't know why that sentence sounded like not. Anyway, um, I'm so tired. Like I could literally crawl into bed and fall asleep right now, especially because I'm so full from dinner. Like, ugh. but I need to take a shower and sometimes I will take a bath and just like watch a show or read a book right now. Like that's honestly such a relaxing, get ready for bed vibe, but that is not the vibe tonight. Tonight I'm gonna take a shower and then I'm gonna play some Call of Duty. And for anyone else who plays games, I love this Call of Duty. I think it's so fun. I'm currently grinding my camos. I have two gold guns. I know it's not that many, but I also don't play that often because I'm always busy, but I'm working on my third right now. Actually, I think I almost have my third. So I'll be working on my fourth after tonight. All right, I'm gonna take a quick shower. All showered up and now I'm gonna do my nighttime skincare routine. I honestly don't even know what this skincare routine is. Um, this was like a PR package and I just followed the directions, but I feel like it makes my skin so nice. So don't ask me any questions. I don't know anything. That was step one. I think I actually just did that backwards. I think I was supposed to do this first. I'm okay feeling like tonight needs to be a journaling night, um, a take thoughts captive time of night because my brain is just like, hating itself right now. I don't know why. If anyone else has ever struggled with like mental health, don't get me wrong, I'm bounce ahead where I used to be, but I mean, sometimes my brain is just like, it's a battleground. But when it is battleground, I just gotta take those thoughts captive, which I don't always do, but I was listening to worship music in the shower. I feel better and I just, I just need a moment of that, you know? Writing down my thoughts and then writing what the reality is really gives me a lot of perspective, calms me down, and just helps me like be content with life. 
And the best part about all of this is, I didn't even wash my hair, I just put it up for the aesthetic. <laughs> Why am I like this? Now brush it out, brush my bangs down, and boom, I'm ready for bed. I actually have my favorite shirt to sleep in under this, so I really am ready for bed. I'll just take off my sweatshirt and go to sleep. But let's do other things first. Also, remember when I said that it's not a 5 to 9 for me, it's like a 5 to 1 a.m.? Yeah, it's already 12.30 at night, and I am definitely could go to sleep after, like, journaling, but I definitely want to play some Call of Duty, so, yeah, I'm probably gonna stay up late. I stay up late a lot. I try to be in bed by midnight every night, and I feel like that's actually not that bad. I really need some water, and I don't want to go back downstairs, so this is, like, a week-old water. Is that okay to drink? Does water go bad? It tastes fine to me. I mean, it's not, like, fresh cold but it's fine xbox on <laughs> at night and that journaling felt really good just to kind of like clear my mind but I'm not going to pretend like I do that every night that's something I probably should do more often and I need to set my alarm for the morning my alarm that I'll snooze like 10 times not even gonna lie I'm feeling so cozy in bed right now though but I'm gonna go turn all the lights off and you guys should go to bed too actually I don't know what time you're watching this, so. Before I frill frill go to bed, I gotta go pee. Okay, good night. <laughs>